Through the years uh, that I've been in practice, not only as a chiropractor but as a nutritionist before then, one of the most common problems I've helped people with is sugar regulation. Because sugar regulation problems are so rampant, uh, pretty much everyone I've ever spoken to uh, has needed some help in that regard. Every person I've spoken to as a patient, that is. So there's two categories of sugar regulation challenges. One is low blood sugar, called hypoglycemia. The other is high blood sugar, categorized as insulin resistance or diabetes. Low blood sugar is often the precursor to insulin resistance and diabetes. So the symptoms of low blood sugar include fatigue, irritability, headaches, cravings for sweets. The symptoms of high blood sugar include those same symptoms. So the way to differentiate is by the following. If you have low blood sugar as a pr predominant pattern, when you eat a meal, typically you have an increase of energy because blood sugar is rising. However, if you have high blood sugar and you eat a meal, after the meal you'll tend to get tired, especially if the meal has a lot of carbohydrate. And that's because with high blood sugar, typically there is insulin resistance, in which case insulin cannot carry the sugar into the cell, so it remains in the bloodstream. The body then rapidly starts converting it into fat, especially triglycerides. And that's a very energy intensive process leading to fatigue. So measure yourself using those guidelines. And in either case, what's required is what we call the adrenal stress sugar regulation diet. Stop by our office and we'll be happy to give you a copy.